Okay guys, it's Monday and it's almost lunchtime. Oh, hi babes. Um, so what we're gonna do today for lunch is we have a bit of leftover from the other night. Um, so some um, salmon, some rice, but we want some vegetables. So the quickest thing that we could do, I think, is we were thinking maybe some roasted sweet potato. They're all cut up already, so we can just add some oil and some spices and then we'll put it in the oven um it's probably gonna be like 30 to 45 minutes until they're more soft uh they're, they soften so we're gonna take lucky on a quick bathroom walk uh downstairs just so that he can do his business then we'll come back up and we'll have lunch so so what we're going to do we got our sweet potato that we chopped up I'm just going to put this here. I don't know if we're going to use all of it. It's quite a lot of potatoes, so I'm just going to put this there. Let's see how much. Oh, can I do all? Yeah, okay. And then I'll have this as snack, leftover snacks, per se. Okay, so we get this off and then we will wash it to reuse. This is quite a fast, like, thing to put together and then let it bake. Salt, onion powder, garlic powder, paprika, and some black pepper actually so okay guys we're gonna cook dinner so we're gonna make pasta and and a salad so we have the chopped cucumbers chopped tomatoes that's gonna be the base for the salad we also want to get some feta cheese and we're gonna make a... Wait, did I take... One, two... Yeah, and we're also gonna make a mushroom pasta. So, we're gonna start off with boiling some water for the pasta. Okay guys, you guys want linguine pasta or, or like the, uh, the big tube one? Do you think this is enough, babe, Linguini? No. We can do both. That's gonna be really weird, Julia. <laughs> we can do both. We're doing the loops. We're doing. Are you sure? Yeah. Mara, can you come and help me look for it, please? Is it ready to turn? It's in the second. Okay. So we're gonna boil the water. We're gonna let that do its thing. What? Water. This is gonna be really bad. My accent's really bad. Okay, and then we're gonna chop and assemble some ingredients. So I'm gonna put you guys, oh. Put you guys here. So I already chopped the tomatoes, the, the top, yeah. Tomatoes, cucumbers, and mushrooms. What I need is basically the onion, the red onion we just bought. for the salad and then it's a mushroom white sauce based um, recipe so that should be fine. I'm just gonna cut this up. Hey okay guys, added in the mushroom. I'm waiting for the moisture to like 
shrink them per se. So we'll wait that out for a little bit. I might add more cream and pasta water actually. Let's see where this is. Mark just poured our gorgeous salad dressing and added some feta cheese. So this is gonna be our Mediterranean salad. Just gonna... Mm. A little truffle on mine. So this is what is it a set of like? just finished a couple tasks so I'm in a kitchen and I'm over viewing my broth that I've been making all morning oh by the way little update we added the shelves for the coffee nook and I just got a package it's an Aritzia package these packages look at her Oh, that was short lived, but it's so cute. Yeah, it's nice. Ready? So, yeah, I got the. What's it called exactly before I butchered this name? It's a TNA quarter, like, no, half zip up, and it's the hip version. Like that, so it's not a full zip. I got it in a size small, and I usually always have like initially I wanted the gray one, but the gray one only have it in the crop version of this, and I, I wanted like the hip length. And uh, I was debating between this rich brown color or the beige one. I feel like I have a lot of beige, so I figured why not? Um, this was kind of on. So guys, be ready and be sick of me. Yeah, we're going to a chalet this weekend. This is what I'm gonna live in. This is it. Good morning guys, um, last night we arrived quite late to the chalet after a 4 hour drive so to those who don't know what a chalet is, it's a cottage out of the city um, we chose this one closer to Quebec City so it was like a 4 hour drive from Montreal and because we got here late, didn't get to kind of like show you around honestly we were very tired, we just ate food, thank god my friend Zoe and her girlfriend Hayes were able to cook us dinner for once we got here, so that was really nice. But afterwards, we pretty much were dead. So let's get ready together for the day and come along. How about 
use this um, triple size cleanser since Asia actually, I forgot how nice it is. I really, really like the Tantra products, they're just mad expensive. But we'll see if I restock with um, the November sale with Sephora. That'll be nice. Okay. okay, for my skincare, I made it really simple this weekend. Not bringing out or anything, so that's good. Using Mugwort Egg Mugwort Essence. Pretty much. My first skin's been doing really well since we moved, so I figured very simple. Again, this is the travel size. I like using the travel size. Um, this is the only thing that's not travel size. It's the Biosan Squalane and Copper Peptide Serum. This is actually a really nice, pretty good serum, if you ask me. Come sit down. I've been using the Kala Ka Kal Soul Wrinkly Balance Balm one. So I do this like under my eyes. It moisturizes my eyes. Kind of the, the laughing lines. Foggy, but that's fine. I'm using my jet lag one, so very hydrating. It's getting the season where I get really dry skin, so. I'm using the Centella sunscreen. There you go. This spreads like butter. I found a Tower 28 SOS Spray Deep. It's on Amazon, guys. Um, and it's for a fraction of the price. The yeah. for Panda, the Tower. 28 SOS spray, it's like $33 prior to taxes. This on Amazon is $18 a bottle, it's a bigger bottle. And then you can also buy the refilling bottles. That's even cheaper. So, red spray cap. Okay. I've been using this as a base. My skin is pretty good, so I'm just gonna do it with my under eye. And just evenly key to glow skin in between always have a moisturizing spray and mist so this is a mist spray but also a fixer so Fenty Beauty and Mocha using the Too Cool palette. This is, I think, a lighter color, so like that's what it looks like. I use this to heat up 
and curl my lashes to turn it on while I do my last layers of stuff. I've been using the Kosas blush and I've been using the Gliss blush for life. So I do powder first. to the mirror. Like for Asian lashes, this will go really well. And last but not least, the Lash Cloth Mascara number two from Yves Saint Laurent.
What was the creamer flavor? It's a different one. No, it was. It was. Delicious French toast. Look at that. Don't mind all the powdered sugar. It's just for the look. Yeah. <laughs> Hi, Hi. 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 Just came back from the walk. So we're gonna just chop, read, and We'll get ready for the chop. Book number 38 of the year. It's done? Yeah. Okay, if you could... You're gonna put it back in the pan? No, oh, yeah, so like, if you could put it... Oh. Put it in the pan? No, I think that's too much. Put it back in the pot, and then I'll pour it in the pan. Just served. Guys, so we're hosting a themed birthday dinner for Lexi tonight. So it's gonna be in her lover's era, like Taylor Swift inspired. So Lexi's version. 425? Oh my god. Guys, Hazel just got surgery. Is her cone of shame. Um, so yeah, 
the goal is, give me a second. Okay, so as I was saying, it's Lucky's birthday. So Hannah's gonna get here in like literally five seconds. We're doing a charcuterie, we're doing oysters, we're doing pasta, we're doing cake. So we're gonna like try to make the table very pink and all that. So yeah, let's see how it goes. I'm really excited for to host like a first themed girls dinner at our new place. So yeah. <laughs> 